Hey guys, welcome back. I just wanted to briefly show you guys and just kind of talk about just how easy it is to get bubble algae into your main system and everywhere else, to be quite honest. Um, if you see that white spot on the rock, there's a little cave right there. We're going to zoom in here in just a second, right about there. And there's a little colony of bubble algae bubbles that are freaking tiny, like tiny. And you know, how do you, how do you remove that from the rock? I mean, I have a really tiny pair of tweezers that I'm going to try to do it with, but if you pop it, it could proliferate in the tank later on because those little spores inside can just go into the rock and cling to it. I'm sure. And then six months later, when your nutrients are elevated or something like that, boom. And I've definitely had this happen before. But the last time that it happened, I actually popped the bubbles. So I can show you that real quick right now. As you can see, this is really fun. And I did pop the bubbles and they proliferated. Looking at this picture right here, you can see how they basically divide off of that one bubble. You definitely don't want to get this particular species in your tank. Just take my word on that. For me, it seemed like they were spreading from the spores. There's tiny little bubbles just like there were in that rock that spread all over the tank. They got on this overflow elbow and they just basically went crazy in the tank. So when you buy live rock, it's inevitable that things are going to get into the system. And it's sad, but it's true because we all want that beautiful tank without any pest that just runs perfectly. But sometimes I think in the real world, all the pictures that we see on Instagram and all those different things, it really doesn't exist. They probably have a lot of problems that you just do not see and it is what it is it's it's just reefing in general so i hope you enjoyed this video guys i just wanted to show you how easy it is for it to come in and with that said we'll catch you on the next video